Hello, my dear friend. Uh, logical inference ko second part is here. Uh, let's get going. If you haven't watched the first part, then it's out here. Click this button and then watch the first part first. Kina banda kiri agadi alik bujno sahar parsa on the first part here. Bini second part mat chali bujin sab. So tell her nos. Okay, and if you have watched the first part, then let's get going. Okay, so first part, I explain the main basic concept about it. And I invented one question which many of you liked. Uh, that was nice. So, and let's try Alikati is slightly different types of questions. So that overall I'm understanding your topic could be same. Oh, okay. So uh, given the statement, buses are the cause of more accidents than cars. Okay, so bus ko accident is more than cars. And truck cause fewer accidents than buses. So, bus le truck live in GTO. Truck ra car ko ki cha relation banek chayna. Okay. Which of the following conclusions can we draw? There are more buses on the road than trucks. Uno saak sa, bus besi ba, accident besi ba ko, uno saak sa, probabilistically speaking. Tab tis to kai explicitly le hek chayna, anta hai, first part ma, dere khep dekhi hun ki directly le hek chayna ni, it's not the answer statement le lai. We are correct, China. Still, statement was kind of like China bus basis. So, this is not the answer. Car drivers are more careful than bus drivers. Okay, now, here is car accident is obviously fewer than that of buses, and you are very much tempted. Now, B is the right answer. Like, there is a big temptation. But think about it. Suppose car is 5 and the bus is 5 who knows bus basis? Ch ki abe kahi bani ko chahiye ni bus basis ch. Tere ko the accident basis bhago. And the car kothi orda ch. Panch orda car le to kothi accident karna. Panch orda bus ch bani. Hai na? Even if bus driver is more careful, right? So bus driver ch five times more careful ch bani bani. Bus adi basis ch. Probabilistically speaking, car ko bande the bus ke basis accident hunsa ni. So I bani sok dena kya? Ki car drivers are more careful bani na. Now the statement is explicitly Car drivers are more careful Right Because we don't know the number of cars And other details So you can Okay, how many people have this statement But not sure When we do probability and all that These things will be even more like Or they deeply clear Okay, truck drivers are more skilled than Either car or bus drivers A car or bus relation Is Number of cars, trucks, buses, kati ho. Tiyo bun tha chai na. Tile karta aimle bannu saak dena kya ho. So you bun hi na. So none of the above is the correct answer. So I hope you got it. Ali kati. Uh, it's like. It, it sounds simple but it can be difficult unza ni. Because aile mo bannu saak dena kya ho. Tapele thikke ho bannu unza. Tara exam ko bela ma. It's like so difficult not to tick B unza ni. Car drivers are more careful than bus drivers. Like it's so difficult. So that's why deep understanding is, re is required. And that's why you have to do a good amount of practice. Okay. So let's go to the next question. Uh, consider the following statement. We shall go either for picnic or trekking. So we. Either we'll go for picnic or trekking. Okay, simple. Which one of the following, if true, would falsify this claim? When you say, this is statement, which is true, by this statement is false. So, let's check it out. We go for trekking, but not, we go for picnic, but not for trekking. When you say, picnic, go, trekking, go. So, your statement is false. We are going either picnic or trekking. So, this is not the answer. Activities such as picnic and trekking are encouraged by health authorities. So, LHA, your statement like falsify just the lag because we have to see the statement that falsify this claim. So, you open your inner. We go for trekking and not for picnic. This is just the reverse of A. So, LHA falsify because we have to go for either trekking or picnic. Okay, now D is the so D is right answer. But let's just check it out. We do not go either for picnic or trekking. 
Yes, this is the correct answer. Kina ki ya kya banega sir? We shall go either for picnic or trekking. I mean, do it. I mean, yada ta jaane. We shall go. So I am go jaane go ne bani. So this statement false by yale. Okay, so D is the correct answer. Very simple, right? Okay, now let's go to this question. This one is a connected question. Uh, let's do it as solve answer. Question number three and question number four, and you can. Pause the video and solve. This is question number three. Now the your statement use garera. Question number four puni solve unja. Right. So you can pause the video and try. And I hope previous questions pun tapa le pause garera ke try garna baala. Te sare garna ba banche. Tapa ko understanding will be even more deeper. Okay. Now let's try this question. No supporters of party X. Okay. Kuni. कुनै पनि सपोर्टर पार्टी एक्स को जोले चे उन्यू जेड जोले जेड लाई चिन्ने थियो एंड सपोर्टेड हिज कैंपेन स्ट्रेटजी अग्रीड फॉर द अलायंस विथ पार्टी वाई बट सम ऑफ देम हैड फ्रेंड्स इन पार्टी वाई ओके लेट अस ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस एउटा पार्टी एक्स छ पार्टी एक्स छ ठीक छ हैन पार्टी एक्स छ अ no supporters of party X पने को who knew Z so party X मा there are supporters who knew Z okay party X मा supporters छा who knew Z okay no supporters of party X who knew Z and supported his campaign strategy okay they knew Z and supported his campaign strategy टीटे उनु परे चीने को मते उनु बाएना चीने को मुनु परे अंत supported his party campaign strategy Agreed for alliance with party Y. Okay. Very simple. So there is a party Y also. So no supporters of party X. Who knew Z? Z like in a party supporters. I mean green man. So your green supporters say did not agree with a alliance with party Y. They did not agree. Okay. सिंपल छ सिंपल छ बट सम अफ देम हैड फ्रेंड्स इन पार्टी वाई तर साथीहरु चाहिँ थिए रे फेरि दे हैड फ्रेंड्स बट दे डिड नॉट सपोर्ट सम अफ देम हैड फ्रेंड्स भनेको ऑल अफ देम पनि हैन नो अलायंस नो अलायंस भन्नु न दे डिड नॉट वांट अलायंस विथ पार्टी वाई ओके सिंपल स्टेटमेंट सिंपल भन्दा अलिकति ट्विस्ट गर्न खोजेको छ Okay, with reference to the above information, which one of the following statement must be true? Okay, which one of the following statement must be true? Okay, sir. That is the question. Oh, some supporters of party Y did not agree for alliance with party X. क्यों तो बने चाहिए ना? Party Y को alliance को किए छह उन्हर को वो ये कहीं बने चाहिए ना? Double statement minus. So यो है ना? There is at least one supporter of party Y who knew some supporters of party X as a friend. That could be true because some supporters of party Y, party X, who knew Z, did not want an alliance with party Y, but they had friends in party Y. Right? So, Jojo, Nepal, you are a good one. Jojo, party X, who was a supporter, who was a Z campaign strategy, who was a Z campaign strategy, who was a supporter, they did not want alliance with party Y. No supporters of party X. Pane ra yu kura lalik twist karnu khoja jek cha ki. Yela Nepali ma translate karu bane ra panum. Kunai puni party X ko supporter. Jolle che part, jolle che jet lai chin thio. Anto usko campaign strategy lai uyo support kar thio. Unar le che party Y si ta alliance karnu chan chako thi na bande cha ho. तर कुनै को कस को मा को को सम अफ देम को को उनीहरु चे साथीहरु थियो पार्टी वाई मा सो दिस वन इज ट्रु देयर इज एट लीस्ट वन सपोर्टर ऑफ पार्टी वाई पार्टी वाई को कोई न कोई तो सपोर्टर होला हु इज फ्रेंड्स विथ पार्टी एक्स राइट सो दिस वन इज ट्रु इट्स वेरी कन्फ्युजिंग आई नो यू कैन लाइक एक फेरी यो भिडियो ला हेर्नुस यो स्टेटमेन्ट ला बुझ्नुस no supporter of party X, one day, sir. 
who knew Z, okay, and supported his campaign strategy, agreed for alliance with party Y. त्यो बने को क्यों मत चले बुजनुस, okay. No supporter of party X supported Z's campaign strategy. त्यो बने क्यों ना? There, here they are trying to play with the words. You know, no supporters of party X supported Z's campaign strategy. ऐसो मत ये था. No supporters of party X ले एक सा. वो की जस्तो था. तर आई ना. क्या बंदे सा बने खेरी? You see ले क्या बंदे सा. Party X को कुने ही पुने supporter ले Z को campaign strategy support करेगो छाई ना बंदे सा. हमरे statement ले क्या बंदे सा बनी? पार्टी एक्स को जो जो सपोर्टर ले हु न्यू जेड एंड सपोर्टेड हिज कैंपेन स्ट्रेटेजी एग्रीड फॉर अलायंस विद पार्टी वाई बंदा केरी पार्टी एक्स को सब पार्टी एक्स को सपोर्टर ले जेड लाये था चीन था थियो ना सो नो सपोर्टर्स ऑफ उत्तियो तो आई ना सपोर्टेड हिज कैंपेन स्ट्रेटेजी बंदे सा नो सपोर्टर्स से एग्रीड फॉर अल Okay, let me let me say this again because this one I hope Okay, statement C like on this sir. Let's try to see. No supporters of party X supported Z's campaign strategy. Simple statement on this. Keep on this one. Party X ko kosalim Z ko campaign strategy. Man X hai na on this. Ab yeh matim test test hai lehe sir. No supporters of party X one era. They are trying to confuse us with the words, but don't get confused. No supporters of party X on this, sir. I mean, comma logak, sir. Can the king agreed for alliance with party Y on this, sir? Has kura say yo. No supporters of party X agreed for alliance with party Y. Thus, party X who cost to support her on the here is a bracket man, a bracket manus, my bracket like X who knew Z and supported his campaign strategy. So, party X को जो जो सपोर्टर ले चे, Z लाइ चीन दाई थियो, अन्द उसको campaign strategy ले सपोर्ट कर थियो, उनारू ले चे, they did not agree for alliance with party Y बने को, so यो statement पुन रोंग हो, party X मा को को छो, who knew Z and supported his campaign strategy, right? I hope you got it, it's quite complicated, उनारू ले like words life खेला है रखे, confused गनु खोद देशा, तर don't get confused. No supporters of party X knew Z. That's the opinion. You have been same. They are trying to do the same thing. No supporters of party X knew Z. No supporters of party X who knew Z. They are trying to confuse you. And that's why I listened to part 1. I listened to this part. Confused now. That's why I wanted to take this question. This question is very important. I am going to disrupt the concept of the concept of the concept. But try to understand the whole sentence. What it is trying to say. No supporters of party X knew that. So, one of them, no supporters of party X who knew that. Party X has no supporters who have no Z-Lite team. They have no alliance with YC. So, that's it. Now, party X has no supporters who have no Z-Lite team. There is no support for any of the party Y. They have no party Y. So, that is what our statement is trying to say. So, that is what our statement is trying to say. And D is trying to say something different. Okay, so I hope you got it. Or if you didn't get it, like you can leave it in the comment. We can discuss it there, you know. But this is what it means, and this question is like very, very important. I really wanted to take this up for that reason. Oh, so I hope you got it. I've tried my best to explain this. And so let's move forward now. Okay, with reference to the above information, above information, man, your information, topic, go. ये माले माले बाहर यो यो इनफॉरमेशन बिकॉज़ दिस इज़ लाइक अ क्वेश्चन कॉमन टू बोथ कंसीडर द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट्स बंदे सा सम सपोर्टर्स ऑफ़ पार्टी एक्स न्यूज़ जेट अब ये नोस पार्टी एक्स हु न्यूज़ जेट और की देख माले बंदे सो पार्टी एक्स में कोई ना कोई चार्ज जो ले जेट लाई some supporters of party X who oppose Z's campaign strategy knew Z. अब Z को campaign strategy oppose करेगो तो ये डाला statement पड़ी सकता हूँ कहीं चाहिए ना? तो your statement भी नहीं हुई ना? Okay, no supporters of party X supported Z's campaign. अब त्यों बने चाहिए ना? अब ये they they are again trying to play with our words कि no supporters of party X who knew Z and supported his campaign strategy. 
सो वो यहाँ भन्नु खोजे को पार्टी एक्स में को को जेड लिंक अत उसको उसको कैंपेन स्ट्रैटेजी सपोर्ट करो पार्टी सपोर्टर से कोई पुनि दे डोन्ट एग्री फर अलायस विथ पार्टी वाई ओके सो यो होता व्हाट इज द करेक्ट आंसर ए ओन्ली आई होप यू गट इट हो घरी घरी मैं यही कुरा भाई कतिजना ने अगि बुझी सकूक थे तब बोरिंग लगे हो मैं कति खेप एवटे कुछ जो बट समटाइम्स यू गेट कन्फ्यूज हो एंड थिंक इन द पर्स्पेक्टिव अफ एन इक्जाम वेन यू आर इन द इक्जाम हल इट्स रियली टफ लाइक टू लाइक हो वेन यू गेट दिस काइंड अफ मिस्ड अफ सीचुएसन्स योम राइट हो तो राइट हो सो मोर यू प्क्टिस द मोर कन्फिडेन्ट यूल बी अंत प्क्टिस के भादी जे पाएते है कंसेपचुअल कंसेप्ट बिल्डिंग कोईसन्स एंड यूपीएससी को कोईसन्स क्योंकि यूपीएससी लेवल इज व्हाट वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग इन आर कंबाइंड रिक्रुटमेंट एक्जाम यूपीएससी लेवल और बिलो दैट नट अब दैट राइट सो दैट विल लाइक के हिट द बुल्स आई भनम न यूपीएससी को कोईसन्स एंड कंसेप्ट बिल्डिंग इज भेरी इंपोर्टेंट बिकज विदउट योर कंसेप्ट हाउ विल यू सल्व द कोईसन्स राइट सो दिस इज विथ लॉजिकल इन्फ्लुएंस को पार्ट टू ओके सो भिडियो एडिटिंग के चाल पाइय भादा खेल आई मेड द मिस्टेक विच आई हेव टोल्ड यू नट टू मेक बट आई माइ सेल्फ मेड दैट मिस्टेक क्वेश्चन के सोधे भादा खेल विच अफ द फलोइंग गिवन स्टेटमेंट इज आर नट करेक्ट सोधे सो वन इज करेक्ट टू एंड थ्री इज नट करेक्ट टू एंड थ्री इज नट करेक्ट सो दिस इज द आंसर दिस इज नट द आंसर सो तब एकदम बुझाने चक्कर में मैं मेन कोईसन नहीं पढ़् बिर्स अंत यो गलती नगर्न एंड दिस वॉज नाइस दैट आई मेड दिस मिस्टेक सो तब ये मिस्टेक अवोइड कर सोचन के सोचे विच इज नट करेक्ट ओके थैंक यू गाइस ओके सो सो फार सिक्स टपिक्स हेव बीन कवर्ड एंड ऑल दो इट सीम्स जस्ट सिक्स टपिक्स हेव बीन कवर्ड बट मेनी अफ द टपिक्स आर भेरी फास्ट जैसे एरेंजमेंट रबल लाइनअप को चार्टा पार्ट्स थे एंड लॉजिकल इन्फ्लुएंस इज अल्सो भेरी इंपोर्टेंट टपिक सो हाई प्रोबेबिलिटी टपिक्स निके कवर भाग बट स्टिल देर आर लस टू गो देर आर स्टिल ट्वेंटी टपिक्स टू बी कवर्ड सम कैन बी डन इन जस्ट अ सींगल भिडियो एंड सम विल रिक्वायर टू टू थ्री भिडियोज सो बट डोन्ट वरी सी सैट को कोर्स में डल्ल कवर भैया and you also do your preparation in parallel don't leave it for the end ki baad ma ma garchu bhanera sang sange garnu bhaye ni math cha esto subject ho ekai talma bujhdaina bistari bistari bujhne kura ho practice gardai garda kheri bujhne kura ho so ekai khep ko lagi na chhodnus parallelly garnus din ma 1 hour to 2 hour che oi esko lagi dinus if your math is like alikati not such a strong subject and then uh पारलर में तब को जो क्रैक एसपीएससी को जो टेस्ट सीरीज को कोर्स है इफ यू डू द क्वेश्चन इन पारल दैन दैट विल बी इवन मोर इंपैक्टफुल सो स्टेट्यून फॉर मोर थैंक यू वेरी मच आई होप यू इंजॉय द वीडियो फ्रॉम नाउ ऑनवर्स द सी सैट वीडियोज विल ओनली बी अवेलेबल इन द क्रैक एसपीएससी एप दैट इज अवेलेबल इन आईओ एस एंड एंड्रॉइड There are three types of packages according to your requirement. Package number one, that is for four ninety nine, which includes CSAT test series only covering maths, aptitude, logic, and reasoning. Questions framed will be concept building and also from previous year questions of UPSC, CSE of past eleven years. Package two, that is for six ninety nine, will include everything in package one plus CSAT videos. and in package 3 you will have everything that is in package 2 plus live doubt clearing sessions which is for 999